Folks, hello and welcome to Tavern Chat. I'm your host, Eric Tenkar, your bartender in the OSR. Yes, I am wearing a red shirt, but I'm going to give you a peek at my red shirt. Number one troubleshooter. By the way, we are at a bed and breakfast, Rachel and I, out here in uh, Canaan, Connecticut. Uh, excuse me as I clear my throat for a second. I know it's, it's, it's a problem. But it's allergy season, and uh, trust me, a lot of people are suffering from allergies. So we are up here in Connecticut in the Berkshire Mountains to enjoy, or have enjoyed, ShireCon. Today was the uh, second day of ShireCon. It started yesterday. There were two game sessions yesterday. Uh, I ran a session of Swords and Wizardry Light slash Blades and Arcana Light for uh, folks on the 5 o'clock session. And then today, this morning, we played in Ian McGartney's Shadow Dark and Bob Goodenoff's Paranoia. Both were great people, but Bob's the one that gave me not just this shirt, but another shirt because I was not just the number one troubleshooter. I was also the team leader, and Bob is very good at giving away tchotchkes, and he gave away tchotchkes. Um, so I, I've learned a few things going to conventions. And if you want to know my thoughts, listen, a venue should have food at it. This one does. It was held at the VFW nearby. Uh, this is a very special VFW. It is open to the public. They have locals that are not veterans that, uh, attend the VFW, go to the VFW's bar, participate in their live music, use their uh, outdoor grill area, which had some very good food at very reasonable prices. So your venue should have food. I'm losing my voice. <clears throat> Again, I'm clearing my throat because I did a lot of talking this weekend. And that's because I got to see a lot of great people. A lot of fans of this channel. A lot of fans of the live stream. Couldn't ask for more. But not only that, got to spend time with a lot of my fellow gamers that are friends of mine that I don't see often enough. So um, I did pick up some stuff on the silent auction. Uh, Rach got, well, I, I, picked, I, I, I won the auction, but it was for Rach. It's a, a very large opening dice bag with like compartments for other stuff within it. So you can really organize your dice sets within, within this one oversized large uh, dice bag. I got some uh, classic Star Trek deck plans for the Enterprise. I got uh, RuneQuest 3, Avalon Hill era publisher of RuneQuest, book about the gods of Glorantha, or box set, I should say. So that kind of helps complete my RuneQuest 3 collection. Yes, a rule set that I collected and wanted to run, never got to run, because I don't think I've understood sorcery in RuneQuest 3. But I digress. It was great seeing other members of the Random Party Generator, uh, Rob Conley, Joe the Lawyer. Um, and it was good to see other people like uh, Tom Wilson, Jeff Talanian, Ian McGartney, uh, Joe Block, and so many others. Uh, these are people, fellow gamers, uh, people in the industry that I only get to see at conventions. So, talk to a few of them about doing certain things, either for this channel or for the blog side. We'll see how that plays out over the next couple of weeks. But as always, this channel uh, and the associated blog and the associated social media, the tavern is for the, the community, all right? It really belongs to you. I am just your main host. And I like to think that, you know, the reason why we have so many co-hosts and so many live streams is because you, as a community, as the viewers of this channel, will like to see and hear other opinions, um, other perspectives. I think that's what keeps gaming fresh and it keeps the community fresh. 
So um, I'm already going to be looking for where we're going to be for next year, ShireCon. I think they've already confirmed that the VFW will be hosting ShireCon again next year. Uh, we're just going to have to uh, arrange where we're going to be staying. Uh, the locust tree, bed and breakfast. I got no complaints. It's a wonderful place. And the breakfast was very nice. That's right. You're laughing in the background and very filling. So, Bob, um, your shirts are very comfortable. I think I have uh, sleep shirts to finally replace my gaming at the beach shirts that I've been using for the last, I don't know, six or seven years. Uh, <laughs> really well done. So a huge tip of the hat and thanks to Bob Goodenough. Uh, back to our regular scheduled planning, uh, sorry, programming. Uh, we are planning, Rachel and I, to do Gamers Health tomorrow night, Sunday, at 8 p.m. So we hope to see many of you there. And I'm sure we'll do a bit of a recap of, uh, of ShireCon. So as always, be safe, be well. God bless. Roll those dice, roll them well. There will be some more pictures going up on the blog side uh, later on tonight if you want to see things from the silent auction that maybe did not sell. And other stuff, you can, you can certainly check it out on the blog. All right, folks. I'll catch you all later. Be good. <laughs>